I'm shy. <laughs> it's been like ages, like almost like two weeks now, guys. Oh my gosh, I've missed you guys. Even if you don't miss me, I missed you. Like I missed, I missed you guys. But anyways, I am back and I am better than ever. Oh my gosh, make the one and nigga wanna me hear me. Hey guys, so today. Before I go over to the video, please, if you are new here, you are very, very welcome. This is not how I am normally. Ask, ask them, ask the other people. This is not how I am. But today, I am very happy because I have gist for you guys. So, if you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe. Give the video a thumbs up before we get right to the video. So today, I'm sure you guys are already ready from the caption. Today, I'll be telling you guys, hmm, why is it not brighty? Oh. All right, my ass got up. So today, I'll be telling you, I'll be gisting you guys about my first day in so 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 school like that. I ain't gonna mention the name for the sake of myself and my years that you take it. What? But my years dedicated to that school, so I'm not gonna you. I'm not gonna jeopardize my five years in that school plus this extra year that coronavirus of course. So for the sake of that, I ain't gonna mention the name of the school. But anyways, I know most of my subscribers are from the same school that I go to. So please don't write the name in the comment section. If not, you're on your own. You're on your own. So I do not beg you. So let's start with the story. It was in the year 2016. I'll be 15. I graduated 15. Then I can't remember. I can't remember. After okay, so first day before the first day when I was going to school for the interview, I met this girl in the bus on the way. I went with my uncle. I met this girl on the bus. So she was like, Are you going to so so school? University, I was like, uh, yes. So like, oh, that she's from that school. That like, school is nice. Blah blah. She was just telling me sweet, sweet. Oh my god! See this girl. I was in, I was in cloud nine. She was just telling me, the one part. She now say, ah, oh, that don't worry. And I asked her, how are the rooms? So like, I oh, don't worry that they are just two in the room. Like, there are only two occupants in the room. I was like, that's dope. That's dope. All right, now we now went. Because we arrived uh, late in the night, so we had to sleep over at the guest house in the school. So, the next day I went for my interview. Then I got the admission, obviously. Then I called my mom, because I didn't call my mom, I went my uncle. So I told my mom that they said I have to resume immediately since I've already, like... Like, they had already said lectures, sort of. So my mom said, okay, that I shouldn't come back home, I should wait there. So she come and meet me there to pay my fees and all that. So we stayed in the guest house for like four days before she came. Then the next day she came, we paid our school fees. I got my accommodation. That's my hostel room. My my hostel room, my hostel name. So I had to get like things for school because guys, do you know what I wrote? The things I wrote in my list. None of them. Let me tell you. I wrote fridge. I wrote television. I wrote gas cooker. What I wrote wardrobe. I, I wrote cutting. What what did I not write inside that list? Only for them to tell me. Hmm. That is bunk we are using. Like, like, like bunk. Bunk. I thought I left that in secondary school now. Why? Why? Bonk. I say okay, it's not bad. I'm used to you. I say bonk. I say okay. so. I say okay, bonk. No wahala, I can manage bonk. Then I say <laughs> okay, it's not then that I even said it before I get the end. So we're going back and forth. We we'll leave school, go and buy this one. They'll ask me if I got some accommodation. I'll lie. I'll say no so that I can leave school with my mother now. Then I say. <laughs> We'll be cooking. <laughs> we cooking by ourselves. Me. Cook. Where? How? Why? 
<laughs> this is funny now, but then I wanted to cry. So my mother said, cook. Cook. Why? It's not a private school. He said, no. That we'll be cooking on our own. No. That we should buy, uh, not even gas, we should buy stove. Me, I don't know how to own stove, but light and light. I don't know how to own stove. They say, Tom, if you buy stove, I say, oh, yeah, now, nah. let's buy stove. We bought stove, we bought pots, we bought food stuff. I was just so confused that day. Why, why are you buying food stuff for me? To, to do with what? To do. Ah, <sighs> God. Everything, everything was like just with him, and she had already paid school fees. So my mother had to wait, babe. Why, why, why? <sighs> so she bought. Pots, she bought stove, she bought kerosene. She, after not looking at them, thought, how am I going to do this? She not, she not said, don't worry, don't worry, that I'll get used to it, get used to what? I cannot cook. She not said, okay, she'll buy cooking book for me again. I was so ashamed when I got school, but forget that she not bought cooking book. They not say, not say, I have to buy cabinets. I said, well, you try this cabinet. They said, that baby, you know, this baby's cabinet now that mothers have for their children. That's what we bought for our stuff. Then what else? Okay, I think we had bought everything basically. I had my box. I had like my food stuff. I thought that was all I would need. I bought only rice. I don't know whether I, what I was planning to do with only rice. So I now went to school. Mom and I said, okay, let's go and buy books. She now went to the bookshop, asked them, what books am I going to need? for this semester they say they don't know i poor right you don't know what she said eh, they don't know that is a lecturer that we decide my mother said ah, ah. Oh. me said well what kind of private school is this one now come we said all right <sighs> i said okay calm down as we're in the library god this girl i don't know who sent her to open her mouth i was with my phone my android phone that time she said, eh, are you a new student? I was like, yes. She like, did they swallow our phone, no? Oh, who, who asked you? Who, who asked? Why did you open your mouth? Annabelle, 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 you! I know you're going to watch this, this thing. I'm calling your name now. Coincidentally, she's one of my best friends, but that girl just ruined my life first semester. Like, why did you open your mouth? She said, they used to have phone, no. we used to cook on our own, just cha-cha-cha-cha. Mom said, eh, hey, oh yeah, give me the phone. Oh, God. So now, I do not have, okay, I had a laptop. I had a laptop. Just so you guys will know, this was my first day in school, though. That was this one that I'm talking. I had a mostly collected the phone. Oh, God. Tears, see, tears were here. Me that can cry very well. That, okay. Security people now asked me, have I got my accommodation? I was like, yes. Then I said, okay, I can't leave the gate with my mother. So my sister said, let's go and eat before she goes. Hey, God. I'm a strong girl because I held that tears. So after that, after we finished eating, my sister was not telling me, oh yeah, now enter Keke. He loaded my things. <clears throat> but, but I was also not happy that things were not going the way I planned. Like, why is everything just going here? Why are things I wrote in my list? I didn't get it. My phone, I couldn't get it inside school. Like, everything. That that was even just the beginning of... That was the beginning of what I was going to face. So we entered the KK. We entered, passed through the hostel gates. I was in the hostels. Very, like, hostel. Luckily for me, I was on the ground floor, not another floor. I was on the ground floor, so he now started offloading my things. I now looked on paper. I was looking for my room number, so I had to be walking, walking, walking. Luckily, it wasn't far from where he dropped me. So, <laughs> remember that girl in the bus that <laughs> told me that there are only two people in the room? <laughs> I saw my room number. I said, uh-uh, let me enter inside. I opened the door. The first thing I saw that met my eye that we jumped at, guys, I saw rats. God, oh my Jesus. Rats. Hey! 
Obey, I'll die. What is Rat looking for inside hostel? That was not all. I, saw, I just saw the rat. Okay, Jesus Christ. The girl started if you see laugh. Hey God, they laugh me. Me. Oh God. They were laughing. I said, let me calm down. The rat has gone. I'm now look inside the room. I'll just stand by the doorway. I've not took my head inside the room. I now look. One, two, three, four. Not four people. Guys, I saw four bunks. That's eight people. That girl lied to me. How does two people turn to eight? As in eight. God, eight. I'm going to the machinery room with eight people. Oh my lord. <sighs> that was when the tears, like, as I just turned back, like, tears actually rolled down. Like, why? How did I get here? Did I do any? God. I packed this. <sighs> I expected that in university I have my room, my toilet my kitchen like a house to myself now i'm gonna be sharing with eight people 80 <laughs> this life no balance ah! ask them where is bunk so because they they numbered the bunks i was like where is bunk so so so, so. ah they gave you that bunk that was what she said and mind you this girl was my namesake fatima but she was hausa i'm not hausa so she um she said ah, they gave you that bunk that somebody's on that bunk i'm like could this day get any worse what what like what did i do i don't know any people from anywhere did i wrong you people please and i waited though they now called the girl they said the girl was in class then she was like that oh that she has project because she was in final year that time she was like oh she has project this thing to do that she's coming she's coming she's coming oh, no. There was an empty bunk there that nobody was staying in. So like, I should stay there for now till she gets a space in another room. I was like, okay, no problem. As far as I have where to sleep, I cannot be stranded in the place I pay for. Oh, now I'm actually getting angry because that day was. <laughs> I was not lying down. I laid down. I removed the clothes, I came in, I changed into a comfortable wear. So I laid on my bed. I was watching a movie because, like, I just wanted to take my mind off it. Like, <sighs> things were just coming one after the other. You see, now I laid on my bed, I was watching a movie. I brought out my charger to charge my laptop. <laughs> I check, I check all the walls, all the four corners around us. I do not see sockets. Uh -uh. What were you? <sighs> Am I in a refugee camp? <sighs> Fatima, please. Where is socket? I'm not seeing socket. Should I? Ah, that there's no socket in any room in this in this school, though. I was like, eh? He said yes. They also said they don't have socket in their room. I'm not understanding what she's saying. There's no socket. How? How? Why? Do you not even check outside the door? Maybe they put one socket outside that will plug extension. I did not see. I thought charging center. As in charging center. I'm not understanding. Charging center, how? Which one is charging? What's charging? I called my mother. I was like, Mommy. I asked her, Are you still around? She was like, No, she has gone. Very good. I was like, You have gone. She was like, Yes, now what is it? I was like, not I'll call you back. That she should show me to the, like, she should show me the charging center. Guys, you know I went there. Let me explain. Let's just say, basically, it's like my room. But there are sockets, sockets, sockets everywhere. And I'm like, what is this? What's this? The only time I've seen this is in maybe uh, all these places they pay. I don't know if you guys have seen places they pay to charge their phones. That's the only time I have seen. It. Like, um, in my mind, I was like, okay, this person that thought of this thing. Now that you have jam pack all these sockets in one place, what if this place now blow? Like, 
Like so many things are showing children, but like what is stopping you from putting sockets in each room now? That you have combined all the sockets inside one place. They here. Because obviously I can't leave it here because uh, in see insinuate anything but I can't leave my laptop here alone. Should I yes now you sit down here and stay with it? I was like I will sit down here and watch my laptop charge. In this hot uh, if you see the number of people, the girls that were there. Ah, I don't die. No fun. <laughs> this is my life. Finding to just go to a federal school so I'll know that. Okay, I'm not sparing anything. Guys, like that. So, I went back to my room. The girl that took my space was still there. She came to get something. So she was like, ah, am I doing anything? I was like, no, I'm not. That. I'm actually, my laptop is dead and I can't leave it there. She was like, okay, do I have to go to class? class <laughs> excuse me excuse you as in just so you put no i know i've touched up food since that food i ate with my mother <laughs> i've not chopped food since morning so now and i say okay because they told me that uh they even had cooking hours like what the fuck no 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 this ain't happening this ain't happening they say once it's 10 you're not supposed to cook and then the naive me i ask them what do you put do on friday <laughs> i was expecting them that okay maybe they so call artists like you know abwa divinem you know abwa they so call artists to perform and others share they say they used to do adoration and i've not heard of that is it the name of the song artist? Like, who is that? I was like, who is that? The adoration now, uh, procession. I don't pro, pro what? Pro. They were like church. Yay! Yay! <laughs> church. life they have seen scatter I was like hey mom see you do me where <laughs> as I judge I say okay let me set my stove <laughs> I've never set stove in my life let me pour kerosene now to hunt the stove I did not know how to hunt it Mary may help me hunt it. She asked me, what do I want to cook? <laughs> and I ran to my bed, brought my cooking book, and oh, guy, they both laugh. They both laugh. They were like, is it good? I, I was reading it, how to make stew. <laughs> they both, all of them were laughing. Like, I'm like, why are these people finding me so funny? Like, this shit ain't funny. Like, I was so frustrated. I knew how to boil rice. Okay, fine. So I put the rice on fire. Then I was like, stew, stew, stew. I remember I don't have tomato. I don't have, sp I did not buy any spice. Guys, I didn't buy no shit. Like, no, hmm. That was how that night is. Hindu me, I shop. Lord, oh, shit. I can't know that day. That day wasn't funny. Up to now that I'm thinking of it, it was not a funny something. It was a very, very depressing level. Like, I didn't know what was happening. Like, it went by so fast. So basically, oh shit, my camera is. Okay. All right, guys. So basically, that is like, that was my experience. My first day. That was just one day in that school. And that was basically what happened so i really hope you guys enjoyed this video because i'm rushing to go somewhere right now so i really hope you guys enjoyed this video please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed hit that bell button so you'll be notified when i post a video and give this video a thumbs up you can also help me by sharing this video guys so thank you guys so so much for watching this video peace out yeah Pooh.